Wake that ass up. Look, man, I want to have a very um, genuine conversation with the people today. And I want I want to know where y'all at, where y'all stand, where does the people stand with this? You know, what's, what's really going on in this American society? And the reason I say that is because... Mandatory mask, check. Mandatory vaccines, on the way. Mandatory microchip, on the way. Mandatory total control, on the way. Now it seems to me like, like America wants this, or America is cool or okay with this. Now, for all my religious people out there who believe in Jesus and y'all believe that there's a man in the sky who's orchestrating things, now is the time that you question your religion because there is no way that a, a righteous God in the sky is ordaining a deadly virus just so you can get a vaccine and a chip and be controlled by this government. There's no way. There's no way a righteous God in the sky will be allowing people to be dying left and right. People just dying left and right from a coronavirus. And then you have other people saying, oh, you know, a lot of people making money. From this pandemic. A lot of people become rich from this pandemic. Oh you know. God God put this virus out here. So we can learn from it. So we can, so we can see a better way in life. Do y'all understand. That for you believers out there. The Bill Gates. The people, the people who created this virus. Because this COVID-19. For, from my research and what I see, this is a man-made virus. This didn't start in no damn Wuhan, China, from no damn meat market. This is a man-made uh, chemical weapon, okay? That's what COVID-19 is. And the reason for this weapon is so you can fall under their control, so you can look at you can look for the government. You can look at the government for a resolution for for safety to make you safe. That's their main way to control you through fear. Once you're scared, they're going to give you a solution. So you're going to look at them like they're the savior. The same person. The same person who made this COVID-19. He's been talking about depopulating the world and a lot of you fools out here i've even talked to people a lot of you fools y'all really believe that the world is overpopulated and if the world is overpopulated to you fools if the world is overpopulated who's to die you if the world is overpopulated who's going to die first you bill gates if this man is telling you the world is overpopulated, do you think he's going to kill himself or kill his family? No. He wants you dead. Okay? Especially us. Especially the black people. They trying to go, they trying to, go to Africa right now. They trying to go to Africa right now. They already got us wearing these. Now they trying to get this. And once they know that they can get all this, of course. They can put a chip in you because you're going to feel like it's safe. Okay? And then once you're chipped, total control. Your money, your identification, your everyday activities, your, your, your routine, your daily routine will all be documented on this microchip. Just like Facebook, Twitter, all this facial recognition and all this stuff, everything's going to be totally controlled through a microchip. They already got you. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all this social media stuff, 
And then if y'all even look at y'all look at the new basketball games, y'all see the little basketball shit. They got the, the virtual crowd up there. But we going into an ugly world. We going into a total controlled world. And this, this mask, this mandatory mask, this shit, check. This is all part of the plan, y'all. This is all part of the plan to get you under that total control to make you feel like these people are your saviors. I want y'all to see this too. God did not create this law. Man created this law. These men and women. Men like this. And this. And this. And this. Men and women like this. And, and, and me, you know, I'm going to call this ass a woman too. All these is women. All of them, they like little boys. and They like doing silly, nasty, satanic shit. I have no respect but no politician. Nowhere. Only one I got some respect for is Katrina Simmons out here in Alabama. Because she try, she's trying. She's doing her thing. She represents. But far as all you governors, mayors, aldermen, presidents, congressmen, I don't give a fuck who you is. Fuck you. Because I know how y'all feel about the people. I know how y'all feel about black people. Fuck y'all. God did not create this law, okay? He did not. There is no God in the sky. The God is in you. Until you find that, these people will control you. If you do not, if you do not believe that God lives inside of you, then these people are going to control you. Because these type of people are the ones who gave you your religion. Especially my black people. Why, why do y'all think the slave master would give the slave a book to save him? Why do y'all think the, the, these Christians, these so-called Christian people, why do y'all think that they colonized and changed our religion to Christianity? So we would praise Europeans. It's simple. Once y'all... This, this, this book, this Bible was made to control you. Even control white folks. It's made to control you. To make you feel, to make you feel that fear that somebody's always watching over you. And that you have to always be good. And always turn the cheek. Whenever somebody do something wrong to you, turn the other cheek because God is watching. Jesus died for your sins so you don't have to do nothing. Just wait to the afterlife. We need to worry about what's going on right here on earth. Right now. Okay? And this is what's going on, y'all. Everybody's walking around with a damn mask on, thinking that they being safe. But at the end of the day, a mask cannot stop a virus, y'all. You hand the hand. That's just like the basketball. These motherfuckers social distancing on the bench. Everybody in separate seats on the bench. But then get on the court. It's hand-to-hand, -hand, full blown contact. That's just like... Playing football, social distancing, and on the bench. And then when you get out there, y'all running and tackling. This is the buffoonery. This is the shit we going through, man. This, this shit is retarded, man. This shit is retarded, for real. And then I even seen this creep right here, uh, Fauci, come out and say he recommend that Americans wear goggles. Wear goggles, goddammit. Wear goggles with your mask to protect yourself. If I see somebody walking around with some damn goggles on and a mask, I'm going to clown your ass on the spot. Because this is all proof that the American public is stupid. And since the since the majority of us are Christians, oh, we, we doomed. We doomed. Because y'all Christians, y'all think that God ordained this. So y'all going to go with the flow, thinking that, okay, if you go through some trials and tribulations here, you got a mansion waiting on you in heaven. Y'all, Christians have to, y'all have to reevaluate your belief because it makes you weak, okay? It might make you strong because you believe and you got this, you, you believe somebody always with you. You know, it makes you strong like that, but it makes you weak as a person. You don't want to do shit about nothing down here on earth. You want, you will let God handle it.
You will see. You will find out. You will find out these people are pedophiles and that they want to depopulate the earth. But you ain't gonna do nothing about it because you feel like God got it. God, God, he gonna have to answer to God at the end of the day. These people don't believe that, y'all. They know they don't have nobody to answer to but they self, and that's why they get away with this shit. Cause you, you stuck on thinking that somebody in the sky gonna save you. And lose that mentality so we can save ourselves and stop being duped and stop being hoodwinked. Because th this is exactly what the fuck going on, y'all. And if y'all want to be total, totally controlled, keep on believing in what you believe. Keep on doing what you do. Because I guarantee y'all, when they come out with this vaccine, they not putting shit in me. So either you're going to be that or you're going to be that. And then majority of y'all get that chip. And get that vaccine, for those of us who don't want to get it, it's going to be hell for us on earth. So y'all better be ready, man. So wake your ass up, man. Stop thinking this government got the best interest for you, because they don't. All this YouTube shit, all this shit don't matter. Fuck this government. We need a whole new change. We need a new power structure. Black people, we need our own nation. Do y'all not hear that they trying to vaccine black people first? They trying to say we the sick people now. You got the sickest people, the historically sickest people on planet Earth trying to tell black people, the most healthiest spiritual people on Earth, that we sick, that we need a vaccine. So like I said, we need our own nation so we can tend to our own. Stop letting these a whole other race of people control what we do. We need our own nation. Wake your ass up, man.